tragic news made official. Twitch's death was a suicide. He killed himself with a gunshot to the head. The medical examiner closed the case with that ruling as new details are emerging about his final day. Sunday, he danced with his wife at home. Tuesday, she rushed to a police station telling cops she knew something was terribly wrong because Twitch suddenly left the house without his car and would not answer her calls. TMZ reports Allison was so insistent that her husband's behavior was out of character that police considered listing him as a critical missing persons case. LAPD examined Twitch and Allison's home for any video clues. The West Valley Unit, I'm in TV investigation. Before a 911 call led them to his body at this Encino, California motel. 38 year male suspicious search. He and Allison shared their dance moves with the world. And proudly, they showed off their three children. Just three weeks ago, they even talked to Jennifer Hudson about expanding their family. I love the little babies. I, lo I love them. And um, to be quite, yeah, it's, it's a constant conversation. When you're dreaming with a broken heart. Twitch, who rose to fame as runner-up on season four of So You Think You Can Dance, came back to the show for an all-star season. And later, he joined Mary Murphy on the judges panel. Of course, we're just absolutely flabbergasted and in shock. I can't believe we're having this conversation. When you heard, what happened? I saw an urgent message from one of my girlfriends. She just kept saying to me over and over again, she said, I can't believe, I, I don't want to be the one to tell you. Twitch is dead, and I, I just fell to the ground. I went behind the dress vendor, and I just curled up in a ball and started bawling. Do you replay conversations in your head now, looking back on, was there like an instance where he took things too hard or he went into a, into a ball because he was, you know, he couldn't express something or he was frustrated or anything? Yeah, of course you go back through conversations or anything. And I can honestly tell you not one time, not one inkling, all my experience with him has never been much, nothing more than joy, laughter, kidding around. Hugs. I mean, that's just how it was. He led to be one of the biggest, most inspirational dancers on our show because of him coming back time and time again, never giving up. And from there on, he just went, psh, he just that, soared after that. That's the tragic irony. The guy who never gave up, gave up. It doesn't make sense. It'll never make sense to me. Twitch was, of course, Ellen DeGeneres' resident DJ and later became a co-executive producer on the show, and he broke down at the end of Ellen's daytime TV run. Something that I'll always remember is that you gave me a place where I can just be myself. And former First Lady Michelle Obama was a frequent guest on The Ellen Show. She posted her own tribute. Stephen was an incredible force, she said. Someone who radiated kindness and positivity and made sure that people around him could feel it too. Guest judge, Twitch! Yeah. Jennifer Lopez, who worked with Twitch on World of Dance, called him such a light and a beautiful soul, shocked and deeply saddened. Great job. Good job. All right. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Twitch had an emotional reunion earlier this year on The Today Show with his mentor, Dr. Tommy Tania Stewart. She's the former dean of the theater department at Alabama State. There would not be a Twitch without, without Dr. Stewart. Like, Stephen Boss said there would be no Twitch without you. What did he give you? He gave me the validation that I was doing the right thing. And Twitch always, always made me feel like whatever I said to him that day helped. And I promise you, I've searched my phone to try to see had he called in the last week. I couldn't find evidence that he called. I think there are so many people who are saying, wait a minute, we didn't really know him, which is a horrifying thought. But you did know him. Stephen Boss was always pleasant, always smiling, always ready to help and inspire other people.